Oh yeah, my name's Nick. This is Corey, and today we're watching Don't Worry Darling, Harry Styles' fantastic mess of a movie. Yeah, and if that fake guys on the Nick just had didn't give you any kind of inclination as to what's about to happen, we're about to have a messy ride today. A very messy ride, because we're gonna be taking shots every time Don't Worry Darling is too weird, too confusing, and just is basically just a mess. Poop, big poop. Oh yeah, here are the shots. <laughs> Shrieking is hurting my face. I'm ready! I apologize for my lack of enthusiasm. I am recently sick. Don't worry, darling. Olivia hold on, Wilde's hold thriller on. follows a couple living in an experimental 1950s community whose idyllic appearance hides a sinister secret. HBO Max will play through the highest quality audio and video available for your <laughs> <laughs> You f***ing idiot. Guys, the whole version of this beautiful masterpiece of commentary is going to be available on patreon.com slash Nick and Corey. And if you really want to support your boys through the pandemic, through global starvation, through the AI takeover, and through the nuclear holocaust, I'm kidding, that one's not gonna happen, then support your boys on Patreon and watch the whole video. And make sure to like and subscribe as we get into this puppy chulo. And also drink along with us if you have no soul. So, my girlfriend has seen this movie and she said that it's actually better than the critics uh, made it out to be. Well, but I, I just saw that, yeah. Harry Styles is awful on it. Well, I saw the Rotten Tomato score. The, the critic score was 30% and the audience score was 75%, so. That usually means that critic don't like, audience kind of like. And, and, Julie was a die-hard One Direction fan. This guy's impressed, like, whoa, she can smile and balance a drink on her head? Holy shit, the girls can balance drinks oh, on whoa, their heads? Oh, whoa, 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 that one girl in the back can do three things. You know what they say She can dance, she can balance a tray on her head, and she can smoke. Focus, right here. <gasps> winner, winner, Holy right hormone here. monster, oh my god! <laughs> Do you think a girl's ability to- Whoa, whoa, whoa. is this this actress's um, take two on having like the last one dancing is, is the May Queen? So, is for all the... those that already know this because we're late to the party, this is Florence Pugh, Pugh, and she was in Midsummer, which we just watched. And Watch they had that on the dance... channel, it's somewhere over here if we want to put it, we're probably gonna forget. Just go to the, the channel page, I don't care. And they had a dance-off competition to see who won- Pants-off, dance-off. Skirt on, dance off. She danced uh, until she died. Well, the, uh, everyone else. It was died. a stamina dancing competition. Yeah. If you know what we're talking about, one apparently, of those. Apparently, it's based on a folk tale in Norwegian times, where there was a, a devil that played the fiddle and made all the children in the village dance until they turned to skeleton and bones, while the parents pleaded for them to stop, but they wouldn't. They have this as a festival now. No, Why? it's just like an old folk story. It's like the gingerbread man, but like naughty. And dancing? Yeah. Naughty dancing? Yeah. Imagine like the gingerbread man, but instead of it being like a cookie, it's like a fat little kid that murders people. And <laughs> a fat little kid? Why is it a fat little kid? Because the gingerbread man's small. And like what else besides like a fat little kid would stab How people? is this tied to Norway? Because they, they had a, a horrible story that turned into a fun little dance. Nonsense right now. And she's pregnant and so she needs another drink at that baby house. What? Wait, what? This is what the did 1950s. He say? This is 1950s. They didn't Hold know on, science We're taking a then. shot to that. No, 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 that's, we can't take a shot to, to non-confirmation of normal standards of well, socializing. You, I just want to quote what he said again. She's pregnant, she needs another, another drink to keep the baby healthy. This is 1950s, this is basically like BC era. They don't know shit about We're taking a shot to that <laughs> That's not gonna go well. Shot to feeding the pregnant kid. Sure. I mean, feeding the baby in the belly some alcohol alley. You're smelly. I'm glad you completed that. That looks she delicious, play, dude. Which, she's never played tennis before. Okay, so so far this entire movie is just what I wish my life was. I, I don't know. You wanna go back to the 50s and be a wealthy uh, businessman? Be able to have drinking parties and eating and all on the cost of what is probably a minimum wage worker's lifestyle. Yeah, we we kind of do that now. We don't we don't do those other fun things. Corey's probably left his room once this month. No, his the house, the house. I'm sorry. This right. month has been like a week long, and I've been sick for half of it. Nick's just trying to throw salt because he's a shady little shit. You're a f shady small. Cut. Oh, it's not the centerpiece. Oh. Not the centerpiece. What's going on? They have earthquakes. This does, this feels suspicious. I don't know if that was an earthquake. Was that a big drill? No. Was that an explosion? No. Are those the progressive materials? Mm -hmm. You can tell me. So does he have a top secret job where he can't share information with her because she's a whammons who doesn't? 
understand and know things. I mean, generally when you have a top secret job, there's levels of like, clearance and stuff. But yes, because she is women, she also can't know. Kiss you and kiss you and cook for no. Okay. Shut up, baby maker, stay in the house. <laughs> wait, wait, if you tell me I'll, I'll live with you, I'll cook for you, I'll sleep with you, I'll, f I'll, I'll do whatever. Dude, this neighborhood looks perfect. Coming home, baby, now. Okay, so this looks like Florida. I'm or California. I'm coming home, baby, now. That's California. Yeah, That's 100% California. A little bit too mountainous to be I Florida. like the syn synchronization. It's still so very Nicole shocking to me that Nick Kroll's in this Seeing movie. Seeing Nick Kroll play a serious role is very bizarre. I wouldn't say it's serious. That's a f nice cul-de-sac, bro. If this is the American dream, then I f want it. Look at that. Every house is f identical. This is supposed to be one of those like utopian dystopia type things. Every utopia is actually a dystopia. A little bit, you know. Uh, okay. What the f You see, what we do for our job is just go drag racing in our cars that can only go 40 miles an hour. We just drive straight to this mountain, and once we get to the mountain, we do guy things. You know, this one time, understand. this one time we were racing, and guess what? Someone beat us while they were running. <laughs> Can you imagine? All right, this isn't like a, a, a nap at the movie itself, but I'm just take a quick shot to just, it's really hammering home. Men do work, women know shit. Women cook, clean, eat, drink while pregnant. Stay home, baby maker. Get back to the kitchen and make me some consumables. I just, I wanna like, I wanna make that a point that we recognize that this is what this movie is thus far. About uh, six Normal minutes gender in, standards. six minutes in, the entire movie thus far has been men have fun, women provide men with the ability to have fun. The way things should be, goddammit. <laughs> this is a joke, you Troglodytes. It's not a joke. Nick Nick believes that. Julie is currently locked in a room. Yeah, cleaning, I mean cleaning Nick's uh, room. Yes, Julie is the is the stay-at-home wife material. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Look at that TV. Spooky, spooky skeletons. They had the skeletons dance on the TV. Dude, that TV was at least seven inches of screen. Wait, so they all do ballet together? Well, no, they do it individually. Shut up. That was a hypothetical question. This looks like they're about to be paraded out to get matched with another man. This Everyone like stand up tall. Slaughtered. Everyone stand tall. Show out your chin. Show out your your under chin. Now smile. You reveal your bosom. Now slowly turn while we pan around the room. Okay. What is this queen bee? That's Chris Pine on the wall. She it, looks like female Hitler. This looks like uh the the one gym in uh, Dodgeball. You ever seen the movie Dodgeball? There's the one Germans who all like have this one photo of uh, David Hasselhoff they pray to, <laughs> but instead it's just Chris Pine. I've never seen that. What? Welcome, Violet. Tell oh, Violet, <laughs> tell the class what you specialize in. I'm really good at making sandwiches <laughs> That's not and what I thought sucking of. balls. I was gonna be like, hi everyone, my name's Violet. Welcome, Violet. Okay, so I'm in AA because I hate my life. <laughs> so do we. We're just trying to keep our babies healthy with all this alcohol. What are you making for the party? My devil bags. Oh my god. Oh, I love deviled I lagged out. I'm sorry. I still haven't finished processing. Deviled eggs is such a 1950s thing. No, it's not. Deviled eggs are f***ing amazing any time of the year. Oh, uh, don't you remember the time where there was no dishwasher or a washing machine or dryer or anything like that? You have to lay everything out. Wait, there was a time before women? We're just gonna- This is- this is the wall- Corey, shut the f*** up! This Corey, is the wall shut the f*** up! No, this is the wall of funny jokes and not funny jokes. You see- The wall of canceling. You're allowed- you're allowed to say Horrible things about women on that side. It's with reference to and the movie. And also get shit on for it. This side is the watch, safe zone. Watch, what, what, this is the difference between these sides. Ha 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 This side's not funny. That's the thing. What is she doing? Meditating? What the f is that? What was that? Was that a subliminal message? But like they left it on too long? Oh, that's very visible. Okay, shot to whatever the f that was. Yeah, that was bizarre. I don't know. This is like in the. You I know, like in, we missed something. You know, in uh, movie yeah. theaters, they say there's subliminal messaging where like they'll put a frame of popcorn on it so that you, you have to go and buy it. I doubt there that. There was just. Happens. It looked like a person with glasses, and I'm not into that right now. So I'm. It made You're me not into that. No. Are you Are you not in the right w wavelength? Not. The full Why'd she do that? Wait, what? Contact. Wait, there's nothing inside the egg. Okay. Double shot, quick. That was an empty egg. It's a simulation, Corey. The, the eggs are fake. Dude, making fake eggs would be harder than real eggs. Imagine she's like freaking out and she's like, her husband gets home. He's like, so where's my eggs? She's like, I what cracked is all of them. They were all empty. What do you got? The egg never came. I guess you can eat the shell. The this egg has calcium, right? The egg can never came. I swear, they sucked all of the eggs out of the shells. All out of the shells, I promise. Please don't beat me, honey, please, no. To empty eggs. I made 
Gross. But mm-hmm. there's one ingredient missing. What else, green beans? What else? I want to hear it. What else? Eggs? No, oh, sorry, we ran out. Damn, this guy's like, what else? What else? I'm this trying to have a feast. I, like, I'm, I'm eating for 40 people. This guy doesn't care about the feast, buddy. Watch him stop in the middle. I was like, did you make the f- eggs? Oh, okay. oh, he doesn't need the eggs. Uh, oh, he's getting his eggs. Shot to that. Shot to that. He's getting what his did, eggs. What did you make for dinner? What did you make for dinner? Well, I made this, 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 and this. Okay, f- all that. You know what I want for dinner? <laughs> you. I, I didn't hear fish. Uh, shot to because they threw good food off the table. True. True, that is wasteful. There's starving children in the simulation. All this woman does all day long is cook and Pilates, and he just threw all that food on the I floor. I think she's okay with getting her eaten instead of dinner. Alice, how many babies should Violet have? Oh, at least seven. What? Huh? Is this because in 1950 they all died? I don't know, three out of every five live. Is this what actually happened with uh, the Cold War? What? Did everyone actually die and this is all nuclear simulation? This isn't Cold War time, this is 1950. That was way later. Cold War started around 1950. You wanna check? See? Ahem! See, later on, 1991 is when it, when it ended. And so and that's- it started in 1947, directly after World War II ended. Yeah, but they're in California, so that didn't matter back then. They weren't involved. Can you, can you just sink in the wrongness for a second so we can go back to the scheduled programming? This isn't, this is Corey relevant. is wrong and we are this moving on. This isn't really relevant. Corey, you don't know your things. No, this isn't, this isn't really relevant right now. It's not relevant because you're wrong. <laughs> you f- <laughs> dumbass! Oh, hi. Hey. Oh, these old shows. Oh, they're kids. <laughs> I there's like small women. Very you. Okay, they don't- Why is Feliz Navidad playing in the background? That's creepy as f- What? That's so weird. I don't what understand happened? it. Wait, these kids, happened? these kids just walk up. They're both wearing the same kind of Mormon ass outfits, being like, "Here, here, here's my Christianity." And then they just don't talk. They just stare at them, smiling. Bye bye. Thank you. Okay. Bye bye bye. Oh, that's, that's f- weird. This is some weird dystopian shit, dude. Actually. No, this is utopian. Kids that don't talk is a very good thing. Well, so again, I don't know if this is the same girl from earlier, but they're like, kids terrify me. Kids are so creepy. I hate children. But like, she has two. She talks about how much of a, a hassle it is to have the little. I'm shows. still trying to wait for like, what's the what's like the meat of this movie? It's so far it's just wham and sucks to be wham. Well, actually, no, it's pretty no, good. It's pretty to be nice. The- pretty, pretty nice, pretty dude. Good. <laughs> you chill at home, make dinner. Husband comes home, eats your <laughs> dinner. Doesn't care about dinner. I haven't really gotten to talk to Frank very much. Frank doesn't have to talk to you. Huh? I'm sorry, I didn't. You have no idea how extraordinary he is. This guy is just grabbing Frank's testicles and just playing with them right now, just fiddling with them. I was just excited. Okay, that was weird. I was waiting for it to be a ball busting moment, but it wasn't. Like I was expecting to be like, you don't know how good Frank is. You don't deserve to talk to him. Yeah, like, but it wasn't. Like just the dad around at the barbecue. Yeah. I'm guessing that guy is the new guy because like there was a Frank new girl. Frank is probably their like overlord. That's Frank. That's Daddy. You can tell he's Daddy because he looks like Charlie Sheen. <laughs> you can tell he's Daddy because he looks down at the people and like he, he has a, ants. He has a midriff. Bill, Violet, I am so happy for you. Welcome to the simulation and become a part of this family. Okay, so it's a cult. I think it's even worse than a cult. I think it's a group of friends. It's a different way. A better way. It's a cult. <laughs> this is Scientology. <laughs> oh, they whispered oh. during her talk. We shouldn't be here. Uh, why? Yeah, why? A couple disagreeing. Oh no, we can't have They didn't even say anything that was that outrageous yet. They just said we have a different way. They didn't explain what yet. Margaret's question is right. It is the good <clears throat> question to ask. Why the hell are we here? Like on Earth, or in the cul-de-sac, or- You're here to suck my balls is why you're here. Safe where we should be. No, I choose, we choose to stand our ground. I don't like that he's talking about standing their ground as if they're like on the trenches of World War II, just getting bombed at and like resisting something. They're in paradise. This is like perfection. It legitimately sounds like one of those people that's like, we're anti-work. We're not gonna be part of the establishment. We're gonna live on our own terms. Let's have a community. 
We're all gonna f each other. <laughs> this is gonna be an orgy commune. Unbridled. Potential of what, my friend? Potential. You're selling us a MLM, but for people, which is what a cult is. Merciless foe at chaos. Why does he say chaos so sexy? Chaos. He's trying to really like get the wives going, you know? Get them. I think that's probably rule number one in this community is if Frank wants to f he gets f Yeah, Frank and f go hand in hand. What are we doing? Changing the world. What are we doing? Changing the world. Yep, he can pipe whoever he wants, buddy. What, how are they changing the world? What are they doing? And discretion above all else, and that what are you saying, man? You haven't said anything, man. Come uh, on, man. I want to take a shot to his speech. The I'm speech so of nothingness. All I can think about right now is that they cut off the bottom of the screen where his midriff is because this shirt keeps rising every time he lifts his arms. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Established dominance. All the women are like, I wish that was me! It's weird that they're cheering. Nick Kroll looks like he eats his nuts. Nick Kroll does eat Chris Pine's nuts. Oh, give us a second, Alice. She'll be fine. Yeah, she's fine. She's a whipper into shape real quick, you know? I have bad dreams. <laughs> what was that? Another subliminal that? message! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I wanna rewind it. Another really quick. subliminal message. They're trying to get us to buy popcorn again. Bad dreams. Oh, oh my <laughs> god, I didn't need to see that. You Corey. know how good I am at timing it though? That was insane. That was good. Honestly, timing. no, honestly, that was incredible. <laughs> Time I'm, I'm impressed as and you caught this one frame. I'm pretty good. What I was can about. I, say? I actually had like. I was in my mind like loading a shotgun shell of an insult, <laughs> about to say like your timing is dog shit, and then you hit me with <laughs> this perfection. This it gamer is perfect. pro gamer moves. <laughs> That's what keeps uh, Corey it's, and uh, it's gold all, Valor Valorant. Lobbies. It's all my Valorant gameplay. My reaction time is excellente. Corey's gold Valorant. <laughs> gold three, buddy. You're gold three now. No, I'm gold two again. <laughs> <laughs> but I was for uh, at least thirty minutes. <laughs> Okay, so what's on her eyes? Uh, it's those uh, receptacles. They keep your eyes open to be and At least that's what I would call them if I was a doctor. <laughs> Luckily, I'm not a doctor. Oh, oh, oh not, oh, the, not oh, the bait kiss. Oh, 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 oh. No one likes the bait kisses. You want a kiss? No, 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 no. You want quick enough? No, no, no. no. Jack, there is no way. Doesn't matter. She was the one that started it. She wasn't starting the cooch party. Oh God, this is more than 365. Jesus. Did they hire Harry just Fine. to I'm adding another rule. It's shot every time there's sex. Jesus. This movie is horny as f dude. He's just finger blasting her in public. Uh, is this even their house? Or is this like a show house? Are they gonna fork right Wait, here? is Chris Pine there watching? Oh my God. Oh, okay. Wait, is he watching through a mirror? Is he judging them? Okay, double shot, because we didn't get it to the first thing. Wait, wait, the first shot was for s and the second shot was for Chris Pine watching? Yeah, disapprovingly. You don't think they go hand in hand as one shot? What was it? It was, I think it was approvingly. That face was like... It was questioning. It was like, yeah. It was your teacher walking around while you're taking a test, seeing you f everything up, and she's just walking around and looks at your paper, it's like, Yep, you're an idiot and just keeps going. No, you know what it is? It's you're a teacher and your student makes a really, really good shitty insult back to someone, like a, a rebuttal, and you're not allowed to laugh because you're a teacher. So you go, <laughs> So like, you're proud on the inside, but on the outside you have to be disapproving. Like, <laughs> it's like, it's like you're a student and the teacher's over here and I'm like, yo, your mom's so fat when she gets on the scale, it breaks. Oh! And then, like, you say something smarter. <laughs> <laughs> That's not fair. You can't give me shit and then say. <laughs> your mom joke about it. Pretend he said it. Your mom joke. <laughs> and then the teacher. And then the teacher's like, I'm not allowed to laugh because it was a good joke. But you're both in trouble to the office. But you high five. Yeah. You're my favorite. All right, shot to that. I'm not saying a joke at all. You want to you want to take a shot to Chris Pine? Chris Pine judging separately at Harry Styles finger blasting Florence Pugh, and he smiled. Refer to them by their character names, Jack. And okay, Chris Frank looked at man finger blast women. They don't have names. I don't know what their names are. Her character's name is hole. Corey. God. <laughs> it is a joke, my dear. Splish splash. Who's ready to dive into summer? Charge that. What is this? What is this scene? What I'm is this so room? confused. This is like a, a, an adult woman's play emporium. 
There's literally a playground. She's practicing vacuuming are in the they, background. Are they looking for things to buy for their house? Is this like a display mall? No, no. They're literally just playing. This is a woman's playground. Is this like a adult woman's version of Barbie Playtime? Like little, you know, like when you play house? Is that what it's called? Yeah, no. Have you ever been to like players or like any like just Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah. You just go Except and you this have- this is for like 50s women? Yeah, adult 1950s women. There was a woman practicing vacuuming a fake set. There was a woman standing by a billboard in a swimsuit. There was another woman just doing dishes and oh, shit. Oh, this fake cleaning is really fun. Ha ha, having ha, so ha. much fun. Ha ha, I'm so much better at this. Ha ha, ha ha. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, this is shot, shot to something. This is madness, dude. It's a 1950s women madness. If they don't want us going out there, they have their reasons. Do you know anything of what's going on whatsoever? Nope, but it's like they live in this isolated little town. It's ba it's basically like a uh, nuke town from Call of Duty. It is nuke town. That's a good <laughs> that is a good description of this. It's that just, is, a, it's that a, is little, a perfect description. It's a little town in the middle of nowhere. Everything else is just desolate desert. And then they just have fun and get fucked all day. But if you leave the town or question things, you die. You get fucked figuratively, which is not satisfying. Not the good kind. No one likes being fucked figuratively. People yeah. like being fucked Sometimes Literally. Peter insinuates yeah. that they're actually making weapons. For what? That it's all happening underground because Frank hey. discovered- What did Frank discover? Uranium? Extra buttholes? Because we believe in the mission. What's the mission? Getting f into next week? What is your job? At home, supporting them, taking care of them. Without that, they couldn't be out there changing the world. Okay, I, I, I wanna- I would acknowledge this with a that, drink. What, what- And another subliminal message of- What did she see? I don't know, Black Swan. There was people dancing. Kind of. It was like a human centipede of ballet dancers. It sat on her face too long. Oh, there was more. Oh, God! What the f***? That one had barf on her mouth. Okay. Ew. Dude, she is ready to eat ass. She needs to exfoliate. Damn. They added a whole bunch of dead skin on her face, and she got no eyebrows. She looks like a raccoon. She does look like a raccoon. Yeah, she got that, she got that dark eye. Rack city, bitch. Rack, rack city, bitch. To whatever Florence is going through, man. Shot to... The women have just as important jobs as the men, taking care of them at home. There's a two in one. And supporting them and f***ing them and feeding them. It is just as important. We are valuable people in society and have way, no other purpose. They could have changed the world if they weren't getting properly satisfied into their robes with the food to fill their tummies and the lips to wrap around their it's very belittling, is what it, it is. is. It's like it's, it's like shit. you know that you know the robot from Rick and Morty where it's like, oh my, my god, is what is my butter? purpose? To spread butter? Ah. Oh my god! Whoa! What? Inaccurate. What? Inaccurate. What happened? Excuse me. Oh, I didn't need to see that again. Wait for it. Wait for it. That's false true. advertising. That is false. He has three quarters of the bed, and she has it's, a quarter. It's the other way around. It is completely the this other. This never happens. Nope. This never, and he has a, more of the sheets. That's also impossible. Yep. This is an impossible circumstance that is proof that this is a simulation. This entire movie is a lie and I dislike it because of this, this particular scene. scene. Exactly that. Shot because it's a mess. You want to take a shot to this? This is the worst part of the movie so far. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the sheets back, woman! <laughs> this has been farthest from the truth. I, this this is, is proof that there's gender inequality. This right is here. this is less believable than them being in a simulation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know it too, girls. You <laughs> know it. Have they not seen a plane before? Sir, what is that flying creature? Is that a bird? That was bizarre. Well, it looks like it's being shot down. No, that was not shooting. Oh, no, oh my god, stop! See, I told you it was going down. That, that plane, it just crashed! Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure you're not imagining things, woman? Drive it. No, uh, I don't go that way. What? I, I don't go that way. <laughs> it's, it's like she's asking him to have sex with a guy. I don't go that way. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go out there alone. That's not my route. I can't. <laughs> Listen, I don't swing that way. <laughs> that's not how things work for me. There's literally a road that goes that way, sir. Yeah, but it's, I, that's not my route. I don't drive that way. He doesn't like... Warning. Hazardous materials ahead, security personnel only. I will say this movie's interesting so far. Why is she walking like she has a limp? She's in despair. She hasn't walked this much before. <laughs> Vacuuming doesn't get this many steps. There's in. no treadmills back there, so like she just doesn't walk. What is this big booba? This is a dome. That's a nipple. 
Doug Dimmadome. <laughs> That'd be hilarious if you walked out. Hi, I'm Doug Dimmadome, owner of the Victory Dimsdale? Victory Town Dimmadome. Dimmad, don't you take no step further. <laughs> if you if you come in here, you're gonna dimmad get decked. <laughs> you're dimmad gonna f around and find out. What is that blob in the background? Do you see it? It's a water droplet. No, it is not. Or a lens flare. It is a balloon. <laughs> no, it's a lens flare. It is potentially a lens flare now. <laughs> You might as well prepare a shot now, because things are about to get really f***ing weird, bud. This looks like a very nice gazebo. It's made out of wood and shit, not like industrialized metal. It's partially industrial. You can tell she walked a far distance because she's f***ed. She, she, she does look like she's been f***ed. She has the JBF hair. Well? Are you gonna f*** around and find out? You walked all this way. It's a mirror. You know how mirrors work? Is it a mirror? Huh? Excuse me? Okay, what this happens? What? Is she finding the central point of the simulation? Okay, so she turned into Wednesday and had a vision. Okay, let's take a shot to whatever- Yeah, she's having like a massive acid trip or something. Oh, it's her visions. Okay. Okay, whatever the f discovery she just made, bud. I, I don't even think she discovered anything. I think she lost memories. The simulation, it is breaking and decomposing into nothingness. This this feels like the, the visual manifestation of brain trauma. <laughs> into this truth. <laughs> you now have schizophrenia! This is, this is honestly like when uh, Edward Elric sacrificed his body and like saw the truth. This yeah. is all the shit he sees. Yep. Yes, to, to many of our fans who have seen Full Metal Alchemist. We make a lot of anime references now. Is she back? Yeah, she, she's- and her hair is all done up to kill- it, it, she's fixed. She's all good now. Did she get taken into the gazebo? No, she's back home. Are you sure? Yeah, she's in her bed. But you see, because she was asleep the whole time, Jack now has to cook. And Jack doesn't know how to cook. Jack's not gonna be happy about her. Look at this! <laughs> she's using a whiskey bottle? <laughs> He's using a whiskey bottle to crush bread. What's going on? I'm making a lovely dinner. Now, we're supposed to have five courses. Unfortunately, I think down to about three. That we're down to three courses? Did he f two of them up already and the other? How did I get home? Trolley, I think. Jack, I got off the trolley. I, I saw a plane crash. She's really good at playing the character who's getting f in her mind from all directions. She did the same exact thing in Midsummer. A really weird dream. I'm sorry. To the credit of, of Jack in this scene, it's like, he would have no f***ing clue what she's True. talking about, because she has not even attempted to explain. Yeah. But how does she explain what she's happened? She's like, wait, how did I get home? Wait, he got off the trolley? He's like, what the f*** are you talking about? I just, I got off work, I came back home, you were asleep. When you promise something, do you keep that promise? Imagine if all you had to listen to wasn't music, but one podcast for the rest of your A life. motivational speaker all day. telling bullshit. Yeah. As someone who's claustrophobic, that looks like a f nightmare. Stuck between a rock and a hard place, huh? She's being smushed, bro. Not the good kind. She she's the not fun kind of Oreo. All right. That was not the fun kind of Oreo. She's the cream in the middle. Okay, that was uh, bizarre to say the least. It's getting smushed, and not like the good kind of smushed. Margaret. Who's Margaret again? The girl who was, whose husband was like, who's saying she's fine, she just needs some rest. Where oh, the one who killed her kid, allegedly? Potentially, yeah. I'm not crazy. You're being ridiculous and you need to stop this. Alice, you know me. First rule of being crazy is you don't say I'm not crazy because then people think you're crazy. <clears throat> that's how it works. You can't just say I'm not crazy. Yeah, that doesn't that's work. That's what a crazy good. person would say is I'm exactly. not crazy. Exactly. You can't say I'm not a serial killer because people are going to think you're a serial killer. Yeah. Yes, that is how mirrors work. Oh shit, she's going off her own. She's gonna get taken out. Ah, oh, main character syndrome. They're all doing the dance and she's just leaving them. Okay. Oh. Oh. She sees herself as Margaret. She's Margaret. Oh. I'm looking at the man in the mirror. Oh, uh, poor shot. Oh, the it thing is happening. Oh God, poor shot. If she poor. cracks the glass, I'm gonna freak out. No! We just did the thing for me! Corey, poor shot! <laughs> Does no one else see it? That's the same thing that happened in It oh, when he ate boy. the kid. She's not seeing anything. She's losing it. She has the illness. 
These violent dreams, they have violent ends. The sickness. How is ballet, honey? Oh, uh, well, you see, I saw a girl herself in a mirror. Oh, and there she is again. That's not a high enough height to die. <laughs> it's like a one-story house. Unless you land perfectly on your neck. Oh. Well. Why would you get on the roof to do that? You could do it on the ground. She wanted a good view. Oompa Loompa Doompa Dee Doo Do I have something special for you? You shouldn't look and you shouldn't see Get back in the house and Cook for me! <laughs> Very good, thank you for saving me! I was gonna say something about B! <laughs> it literally is like Willy Wonka where like they got, they got for looking at something you shouldn't have and you kissed them out. I don't know what to tell you. <coughs> Ted is with her at the hospital right now. He said she needs a few stitches. Her, her imaginary friend Margaret is so extra, by the way. She has to kill herself by banging into a mirror and then herself by cutting her neck off. Getting on a, on roof. a roof. And then falling all dramatically. Jack, I saw it happen. She cut herself open. There was blood everywhere. It's not just a few stitches. Please don't get hysterical. Oh. Wow. Hysterical. That's, that's, that's what you call women in the 1950s. Hysterical. <laughs> Once crazy. they start having opinions. They call them crazy now. Why are they lying about what happened? What are they Alice, shut the f up! You're supposed to cook, clean, and play with my balls! God damn it! Stop having opinions! What's actually happening? Don't ask me that. The development of progressive materials? You know what does that even talk mean? About that. This I'm is how top you. secret clearances work! I'm glad it took you an hour to come to that question. Victory is safe and secure. Wow, that blows. Their one source of media is Frank. No, they had the spooky, scary skeletons playing. How did you know? This on this. No, trust screen. me, I could tell. You're a spooky skeleton master? Yeah. She's gonna see a simulation right now. A breaking of the simulation, at least. It's her. Oh, it's her drowning. It was in reverse, though. Could you tell? It was. But now she's underwater. Why is everything in reverse? Seeing little air bubbles fly for now is kind of funny. Yeah. I feel like that would have been a little bit more like tense if it wasn't in reverse and it looked like she was actually drowning. Yeah. I don't know why they did that in Gaining reverse. Gaining air makes it we I guess it's to see how she got there. I, I okay. What is going on? I don't know, man. I think she's losing her mind. <laughs> I mean, that's supposed to be the implication, but like, honestly, at this point, I don't really care. You know why I don't care? Because if I had this lifestyle where I had literally nothing to worry about or do, why would I want to like, if my husband was working at some facility that was top secret, and it was actually building nukes or some shit. And I was like, oh no, it's dangerous. Okay, back to my life. Ugh. I don't care. Oh my, what the f is she doing? Okay, sure. Um, what? Gotta gotta protect this for my husband's face later, so he can he can cream all over wherever he wants, and that way I won't get dirty. Did she make a call now? This is dangerous. Just finger your mouth. Is she trying to get it off? Just put your finger in your mouth. You see, saran wrap sticky. Huh? Was she just testing if she could die? She's she's practicing new <laughs> kinks. Self asphyxiation. So yeah, autoerotic asphyxiation. That's her new kink. Witnessing a trauma can often lead to distorted memories, even nightmares. Gaslighting. This movie is gaslighting to a T. Success with them. Margaret Watkins. Oh, security. Margaret is a security risk. Security no. risk. Did it say anything about Alice? No, not yet. Understand how she's okay. You wouldn't want me discussing the details of your treatment with my other patients now, would you? Oh, confidentiality, burn. You just got hit with HIPAA, bitch! <laughs> Dude, I don't even know if they had that. Time to snoop. Does he not have a lock on his briefcase? He does. He does. What's the code? Zero, zero, zero. No. One, two, three. Okay, it must not have been hard. You got to open the yeah. first try. You know our position. So glad you came back. You left this. She stole it. She totally stole it. She's you think she thief. pulled something out? Oh yeah, she's a thief. She's a naughty little girl. You can tell. You can tell by the way that she is. Yeah, by her hair. The movie is interesting. I'll give it that so far. It just makes me wish my life was this easy. You want to be a house pet? Even the guy. That's all they do is protecting. go to work and then come back and then they, everything's done for you. <laughs> classified, classified, classified. Very readable. Discretion is a privilege. Final warning. We get nothing from that, goddammit! Why would you have a file that the entire thing is redacted? 
Should we take a shot to the fact that the doctor just put her in her place like a like a little lemons? I just want to take a shot to the file. What was the entire purpose of the file? Just to be like, oh, it's all redacted. There's literally no purpose to that. Oh no, she's drinking whiskey alone. You know what they say about women that do that? They're alcoholics. <laughs> yeah, you're only allowed to drink if you're pregnant. If you keep drink the, alone, then you're bad. To keep the baby healthy. I legitimately don't understand why they showed her taking the, the, the folder. Like, seeing the guy had the folder with the girl's name on it did enough for the scene to show, okay, the girl's crazy. Why take it out and then have it give no information at all? It was big. It must have been, but like, it doesn't mean anything. I don't understand. This is beautiful. Thank you so much for- Is that a feather bottle? Why is young Chris staring at her? Why is he with the doctor, huh? Suspicious. No, that's his job. What? The doctor's the right-hand man to Frank. Yeah, that's suspicious that there's one doctor who's the right hand man to the overlord. I mean, that's just kind of by nature of a cult. That is a shine dress, bro. If you shined a flashlight on that, that would flashbang the entire room. Is she gonna f strip? And all the wives are like, yeah, whatever makes my husband happy. Sure. Yep, this is just, this is a 1950s strip show. I don't know, they did this in the 50s. I thought stripping was like illegal. No, it's it's only publicly bad. But when it's a, and it's a boys club, it's okay. Because, you know, guys can break the rules in the 50s. This is weird. This is when you're too drunk in the club and you-, you And in, you're seeing shit and you're just going nuts. You're, you're in your feels, yeah. Everyone's having a great time and you're like, oh, Nobody yeah. likes me! Oh, and I look hideous today! Oh, and I, uh, uh, I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Poor shot, Corey, this is getting, this is getting scary. The pop brownie's hitting extra hard. Oh, the edibles are kicking in. You like that? You guys like that? You like you naked want some lady? More guys? You like naked lady in a bubble bath? You like that? What the f is going on? Ah, yes. Yeah, so what everyone does after they win an award is they must dance as directed by their employer. <laughs> now dance, boy, dance! Show them how good of a boy you've become! It's like when they win an Oscar or some shit, it's like their ending speech, but instead of talking, they're just like, dance, monkey, dance! <laughs> I, I don't understand this. I... Hey, oh, she is losing it, bro. What's wrong? Honey, what happened? I'm, I'm taking a shot to Jack's sad dancing. He's like the frog performing. The ragtime gal frog. <sighs> I wish they played that song instead. Margaret was right. They're lying about everything. Dance, Jack, dance. And I saw you it. You went out where? Did you leave? Did you leave our development? We were told not to leave, Alice. What are you, what do you think? You're in Wonderland? You're not in Wonderland, Alice. We're in the victory town. Oh, Alice. that actually makes sense. What? That her name is Alice. Alice in Wonderland? Yeah, that makes sense. That that's a, That's a nod. It's more than just a celebration of our freedom from society's arbitrary regulations. That's, it's now shifting from motivational speaker to cult. Yeah, what regulations that are arbitrary that you're avoiding? What, what are you, what are you getting away from? You are behaving like a child. Wow, now the gaslighting is getting heavy. No, you sound no. exactly like Margaret. Shot to the gaslighting. This is yeah. heavy. This is some heavy, heavy Why does this lady care so much? You broke the one rule! The one rule to rule them all! You're not really my friend! You're Sauron! <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sorry Bunny didn't believe you. Oh shit. Ooh, gossip, that's all you had back then because you had no internet. It was just local shit again, talk. you didn't believe Margaret, so... Should anyone believe you? Holy f He's gonna drop the bomb, bomb on her right now. Ba -bum, bomb. He's about to drop the nuclear f bomb right on her head. And he's gonna blackmail with her to pork it. Like you, someone to challenge me. But Margaret wasn't a challenge? No, she slit her throat and jumped off the roof. And yet here you are, preparing dinner like a good girl. Shut your hard <laughs> mouth. So Alice tells me I was a tennis player. Oh, she does. Right? Yeah. I'm confused. So does uh, 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 shot first? Then I need to shot clear, to your, your clear making, my thoughts. You're making dinner like a good girl. Well, that. But I'm gonna clear my thoughts, and I have a, I have a, another thought. Oh boy, let's hear this one out. Does Frank want her to be crazy or not? Does he want? I think Frank wants to play the challenge at this point because he is he is a power hungry. 
asshole. Because prior to him making that statement, I think she had gone full circle into like the seven stages of grief and just came to acceptance. And she's like, F it, you know what? I don't care anymore. Margaret can go f herself. Bunny's a bitch. I'm gonna be a nice housewife and cook and, f and that's it. I'm done. I'm, I'm good. And then he reset her. I'm not playing against the grain anymore. Yeah. So like she would have been cool. She'd have been fine with it. He reset her? Yeah. I mean like. No, no, no. Like she was fine. Like she had the whole breakdown at the event with yeah. Bunny and shit. And she came back and then she was cool. She was cooking for people. She was going to have like nice oh, that's cool. again. Cooking for people, nice and cooking. Yeah, that's it. She was good. She didn't worry about it anymore. And then Frank came over her shoulder and was like, hey, you're right. But no one's going to believe you. <laughs> and then now she's back to square one. Yeah, he just. So he didn't up. say shit. She probably would have gone like back into the simulation. He wants it though. He yeah, wants, he wants, he wants so, to like, play these games. I don't. I, but like, why not Margaret? What's wrong with Margaret? She's just not main character syndrome, I guess. <laughs> Violet, where are you from? Pardon? I said, where are you from? Like physically or like ethnically? Because like one of those is not is a little bit more of an offensive question to ask. Most the women here are from Philadelphia or Baltimore or Chicago. I for one do not miss no, the winters. No. She's challenging the simulation right now. Bill over here is probably one of the worst I'm golf sorry, players. I'm sorry, I'm not quite not. finished. Violet, where did you meet Bill? Ooh. That was a, hey, Peter, shut the f up. And he bent down, picked it up, gave it to you, right? He copy pasted their story? Frank shouldn't have uh, tested her the way he did. He played with fire, but he wanted it, allegedly. I'm curious to hear where she's going with this. You'd think that if you had a simulation this powerful, you'd come up with like, I don't know, more than three backstories. It's like creating yeah. a character in an Write MMO, some NPCs, and they bro. all the same shit. Yeah. What are you? I'm an orc barbarian. Oh, welcome, me too. <laughs> Doctor Collins prescribed you a suite of medications which you were clearly not taking. The question. You know, just some of those tranquilizers to put you down. She thinks that you need help. It That's is breaking, Corey. The simulation is uh, discombobulating. Here, here's an interesting thing. She presents very damning evidence. Hey, how'd you meet? Oh, I'm gonna say it exactly how you met. Oh, what about this other person? Oh, oh, you all met in the same exact way? Oh, how about this? I can tell you exactly where you're from or where you honeymooned. Isn't that weird? Huh, how I know all these things. And Frank is like, oh, she's not taking her crazy pills. Isn't she crazy? Ha ha. And they're like, yeah, isn't she crazy? Just shot to this. Instantly gaslighting. Yeah, shot to this bullshit <laughs> where everyone's just sitting there like drones, like, oh, what? But what could be true is that everyone else there is potentially part of the simulation. They're all programmed. What's, what, so you're saying that she's the only one who's in it? Maybe it's a project on her. Is that why you went out there? Jack didn't know. He did, didn't he? Oh, no, he didn't. No, he didn't. Well, she tried. She woke up in the but bed. He, but he told him to stop talking. Jack, I think you may have overserved your wife. Huh? Overserved your wife? Like too many drinks? I guess so. He angry. Is Jack getting into beating mode? This is the 50s. Is he putting his wife beater on? Getting his boxing gloves, time to go out to the ring. I was expecting so much more from you. Why did everyone else leave? Because, Too awkward? Because the queen bee left and so they had to follow because they can't be seen as, I don't know, disagreeing. Oh. You were so close, so close. You she had it. You ever put your hand? Well, she had the right argument and then she just let someone dissuade her. Talking about how they all know everything about their backstories is a pretty compelling thing. She needed more allies. I need you to listen to me. Think, Jack, think! He, he's thinking about getting a new model. It's like, ah, oh, All right. This baby gotta, maker's broken. Gotta reset all the other whammons in here and get another, get another model in. I don't want to be here anymore. I need to leave. Where do they go? How do you leave the, how do you leave Westworld, huh? Okay. Okay. <sighs> Yeah, they just they just exchanged four different types of okays in the last few minutes. No, his, his is a reserved. Ah, oh, okay, gotta gotta kill this one. Trading her in. Go to the car dealership in the morning. Oh, this one's a lemon. This is a broken model. You're not gonna wake up tomorrow, are you? Little little Alice. I thought he was gonna have a little bit more pushback. I think this is fake. It has to be. My pack does that snack in case we drive all night long. <laughs> what? My pack does a snack. You know, this drive out into the middle of nowhere, we have no idea where we're going, but a snack could, it could be good. Baby, we need to go, we need to go. Oompa loompa doompa dee doo. I've got some place I'm taking you. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oompa loompa doompa dee dee. Get the f out the car. 
Come on, bitch, please. <laughs> this door is ajar. No! 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 Where is he going? Cinderella, Cinderella, she left her little slipper. Was he warned that, that this was gonna happen? Sure, I, I guess shot. Why Why is he be like, <laughs> Alice got taken away. Let's see yeah, what happened. Like, he could have just drugged her or something. Oh boy. Time to get that good old lobotomy. This is the 1950s. You could have smacked her around a little bit. <laughs> the biddings will commence until morale improves. <laughs> the line. <laughs> what the f is that? That's the doctor psychologist guy who's also a what's budget she, Superman. What's she biting down on? Just a, a, a mouth guard. It's just a mouth guard, so she didn't bite her tongue off, I guess. Because she got shocked. Can't you see? The shock and all the memories out of her and replacing them with other memories of them just, just They just keep hitting her with that men in black pen. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a, a, a memory rewinder, but they do it too hard, and then she's like, oh, oh, brain's just Hello, before. my name's Alice. I'm five. <laughs> I like eggs. Done. Resident, close her up. Was that her? Needle holder? I yeah, it's an Alice. She's working on herself. They're replacing her with somebody else. So captions are ruining it. No, it was supposed to be implied. See, look, she's she's there now. <laughs> what the f New model activated. Holy shit. Android 18. This is a whole new level of f that just got revealed. What the f is going on? All right, they made him look real rough here. Uh, so I am. I just got they infinitely reset, more confused. They reset the simulation. Now it's a whole new world. Now she thinks that she is a doctor. Shot. I they, don't know. I don't know. They, I don't think that's the theory I'm going. They flipped with. the script. They changed her memories. Now she's a doctor. I just finished a thirty-hour shift. I sewed up twelve people, and I gotta be back in six hours. And I'm so tired. I this simulation must be so much better than the other one for her. How? No, no simulation. No sexy time has to work really hard. 30 hour shift and you have to take a six hour break to go back? Who's this? Is this Jack? That's fair. Welcome home. Oh, she got a little lobotomy? Oh, she's so much better now. Oh, she has a completely different mannerism now. Yeah, it's like almost unrecognizable. Yeah, go, leave her. She's mine now. We're gonna garden. What? Huh, we're gonna garden together. Gardening just means looking at plants and drinking. I think gardening means trimming your pubes. No, they've literally said it. What's wrong with her? I think she's breaking now. I think they take turns breaking and being fixed. She's just walking outside with no pants That's on? That's an outfit. That's the kind of shit that you wear in your house, but you don't go outside wearing no pants. Yeah, for the simulation, getting deeper and deeper as we sink into nothing. I think she's gonna start slowly breaking again. This treatment clearly didn't work. Oh no, she's questioning her reality again. You're gonna need to get a second lobotomy. Uh, uh, Victory Project, applicant number 426. Name, Jack Chambers. Age, 29. This is what Harry Styles would look like if he wasn't rich and famous. Like a normal <laughs> guy. Are you aware that you are down. the physical upkeep of your chosen life? There we go. Wait, how is, how is he in that world? Because he's allowed in. He said they have a certain amount of hours per day they're allowed in. Shot because- Wait, so weird. that's a simulation he lives in? She lives in it permanently because she's a slave. And he lives in it whenever, whenever he He's feels not like at it. work? Yeah. Oh, so when he drives out to work, that's him leaving to go back to his normal life. Yeah. So him being home at the simulation is him just going into that matrix. Yeah. She honestly lives the life of legitimately a trafficked girl. She is a a living doll. Yeah. Obviously. What was the 30 hours in the hospital shift then? Oh, that was probably her real life where like that's her actual job or she didn't have time for him. Maybe, I don't know, I'm trying to figure it out. Is this in instead of her sleep she's doing this? Oh God, this is their escape from their normal sad lives. Welcome to the Victory Project. There are currently 72 active users. <laughs> dead game. <laughs> that's a pretty dead MMO. Sink deeper into the way things are supposed. So this is a simulation utopia. Yeah. From their regular miserable lives. Oh, she broke it. Oh no, her device is malfunctioning. Somehow she just like clicked and remembered everything. Oh, please just stay calm. Why would you lunge at someone? But please stay calm. Yeah, just pause for like 10 seconds. He's like thinking, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Calm down! Calm down, Alice! I love you. I love you. This is breaking down, brother. 
No. That's the the husband wife version of please let me explain. I love you. I love you. Alice, just think. Think about your life and what you actually want. All right, shot. I guess. I don't know how the f she just randomly remembered everything. This is bizarre. You were miserable. You were so unhappy. You hated your life. It was my life. It was my piece of shit. I loved my piece of shit. How does her real body like do anything? Do, like, is she atrophying? Is she? Yeah, is she not being fed? Is he cleaning her poopy butthole every time? Or does she not poop because all he feeds her is water? <laughs> water and alcohol? And you made me feel like I was f***ing crazy. I feel like this would be easier to get someone to join you if you just told them, Hey, yeah, do you want to just go to this? <laughs> hey, do Honestly. you want to play this awesome VR game with me? I'm going to go work and make sure we can stay in this world. You are absolved of any of your worries. Just stay Honestly. here and be pretty. Honestly. That's not wrong. Imagine you were in a relationship and you're, you're your in a relationship, partner, yeah. Your partner comes to you and they're like, and listen. In real life, in real life, by the way, yeah. you hate it. It's yeah. awful. Everything sucks. You're working 30 hours a day. Your partner's like, hey, put on this VR headset. You no longer have to live in this shit world. You get to live an imaginary you happy life. You have a great, life. great, easy life. I'm going to leave for work where I go work in the real world to keep us being able to work in this simulation. Yeah. A lot easier to Explain, isn't it, bud? As long as you didn't have family or friends in the real world, which, assuming this is dystopia and she's working as a doctor, you don't have any because your life sucks. 30 hours for a six hour break? I no, don't know. If, if your life is that bad and like you voluntarily did this, this is a dream come true for somebody. Yeah. There has to be another layer to this bullshit. I don't think it's, it's, it's just because he lied to her. I have a feeling it's going to unfold to another layer. It's going to be a free of the mind. Oh, we're going to be happy. I just We're need a second. Happy. I just We're need gonna... I just a second. Goes to get the gun. This is like the worst hypnotist no. act in the world. Yeah. Just, you'll be happy. You'll be just happy. Be, just stop being unhappy. No, I need a second. You know me. You're gonna be happy. <laughs> what is it? What is, is he trying to ki trying to snap her in half? Oh, what the no. is that? Yeah. No. Smack. <laughs> Wait. Do you die in real life if you die in the simulation? Maybe. I mean, they didn't explain it, but possibly. What happened? He he was hugging me really hard, and I just didn't like the hug, so I kind of like she I was, offered him a she drink. She was so close too. He like almost manipulated her again. What is it? Jack Chambers is dead. The the Avatar Jack Chambers or like the the I think real both. one? Frank created a program and he created a I world. Know. And it's see, this is the one that we were talking about, where it's like she got she she's knows in, she's, she's brainwashed. She's in on the deal. No, she not brainwashed. She was she's cool. accepted it. She yeah. was cool living this easy life while the guy went off and made yeah. money. Bunny, okay? answer me. You need to go what right do you now, think Alice. No. Listen, I'm in on it. I wrote this movie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to take a shot to that. I, I want to take a shot to that. Olivia Wilde wrote this movie. She wrote this movie and she's breaking the fourth wall by saying, I know. I, this is what I would have chosen if she's I- She's breaking the fourth wall. I Her to character say, knows. It's a joke, my dear. I chose this. See? See, she chose it because she wanted the easy life. Kids aren't real. No, they are. They're real Nothing to me. Is they're real. real to me, Alice, Nothing because here they're alive. And here I didn't lose them. Uh, so she's nuts. Can we can but we rewind a bit? And trauma. Can we rewind a bit? Why? Because in every scene that her kids were there, she wasn't even <laughs> touching them. The last yeah, scene she was we saw, really not the kids got off the bus and she was the one yeah. that ran up to them. Well, the other girls just like yeah, on the bus, she's see like smoking a cigarette, being like, "Ugh, the f these kids." Okay. <laughs> in this world, my kids are alive, <laughs> so I can ignore them again. It is really weird. I want to take a shot to that. That makes less sense. Yeah, that is. But my kids are here in this world. So, God, I, I wish I, I want to live in the tour where my kids are alive so I can be a shitty mom like it's before. In the real world, my kids died, so I never got the chance to neglect them. Here, I can have them no, so I can neglect in, them. In the real world, you neglected them too hard and they died. In this world, because they're you not know, real. Somebody could have neglected them for her. Well, in this world, they're not real, so no matter how hard she neglects them, they can't die. Yeah, true. To a butt stuff. You have to go. Here come thing one and thing two. How, yeah, how are the Oompa Loompas here every time, but now they're not? Uh, so I don't understand how the simulation works. Are they uploaded into real bodies? No, this isn't in the real world. Go back inside, Alice. Sweetheart? Yeah. Sweetheart? Sweetheart? Uh... What the f***? What? Why would that happen? Well, <laughs> it's just like a random... The, the one technical engineer is uh, fucking up. Jack's not working, so the light bulb exploded. <laughs> I want a drink to that. They're all, <laughs> there's wait, no- Wait, I wanna see what, what else happens before we drink. Nothing like this could happen. Shut up, Bill! <laughs> Bill, shut up! 
Shut, Shut up, dumbass! Up, Bill. You promised this was never gonna happen. Okay, so the light bulb is blowing up for no reason. Yeah. Go! Go, Alex! Go! 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 It's gonna be a fast runner now. All right, calm down, Dean, you f***ing weirdo. Damn, is she super strong in the simulation? No, she said f*** your bitch ass. Max out her power stat. That's a nice car. I will hit you with this car, bitch. Yeah, that's right. Do you think in a simulation world you could just max out all your stats? Like, why can't they just be super strong? <laughs> I just love the idea that this is a high-speed car chase and they're going like 20 like, miles an hour. <laughs> Cars went that slow, you dumb they're not moving fast. He's probably going at least 70 or 80. No. Th this speed right now, this literally is like 30. That is, no, it's not. That's 30. What kind of 30 is that, you maniac? Look how slow this is. Where's she driving? Is this where headquarters is in butt nowhere? I don't know why this would matter. They're still in a simulation. This is like Mad Max Calm Road. And he's going 27 miles per hour. Bump. Okay, how is her car not fast? Yeah, I know. How is this? It's the sports car that looks like it was made by James Bond slower than a beetle. Sure, yeah. Huh? Of all the things that could happen, how do they set on fire and flip? What? Okay, that was stupid. Take a shot to that. That was f***ing dumb. Holy shit, we're gonna finish the bottle in one movie. That was ridiculous. That was some fast and like sort of mildly furious type shit. <laughs> Moderately quick and kind of angry. <laughs> Where is she? Huge crash. Oh wow, listen to Frank. Mr. Frank. Collins uh, is dead, sir. Mr. I want a challenge. Oh boy, she's not gonna like her simulation now, is she? Frank? Frank, what do we do? This is what happens when you ask people for a challenge. Oh! What? Why? my turn now. It's my turn now? She wants to run the simulation. I I'm so confused. First, again, why did this guy want a challenge? Because he was bored. When you're, okay, Corey, when you have omnipotence, you now want a challenge. You now want someone to f with you. It's for boring. Like, for the shits and giggles, not to, not to ruin your That's entire life. Heaven and perfection and utopia is boring. No one wants utopia. Do you share when f nothing happens to someone? Do you call someone and be like, oh, I got my paycheck again this week. No, you say someone hit my dog in the road with their car. You want that's that? what you share. No, you that, share that's what he did. He drama he teased and someone you share doing new exciting things. You don't share the norm. Let me ask you this. That's why he's more of it. Do you go free solo climbing on a 3000 foot climb, uh, mountain? No, that's what he did. He went up a mountain with no strings attached just for the thrill of it with no upside. He wanted to bust no, one literally, special nut. Literally no upside. Oh, I want a challenge. Oh, oh, and you're you're finally cooking again? Well, well you got your challenge, you're dumbass. bitch. Do you still want it? You know, I really like it when you push, you should keep pushing. Shot to the puppy chulo not getting And why does boy stab him? It's my turn now. I'm really now curious to my, see how this my world. The, the end of this movie will determine whether it's good or not to me. Because so far it's not bad. The end will be the determining factor. Again, they're going like 10 miles an hour, maybe. You are an awful driver, aren't you? You f You woman. I'm, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It's a, it's a joke, my dear. Shut up! Oh, she did make it a perfect- perfectly barricaded. <laughs> Watch, one's gonna hit it, the other one's gonna go flying off the cliff. Well, it's gonna hit it going like 10 miles per hour and explode. Look how slow they're going. Oh, by a little can climb? climb? I'm a f you keep going. What are you looking at, man? They can climb. It's not that steep. This is an intense drum roll. Bro. Now what? You just dive through it or something? You touch it. Is that how it works? Oh, is that how you leave? Touch it. Wait, what? Huh? Didn't she kill him? They showed the scene of him with his eye patchy thing, and he's rolling it back of his head. What happened? You me. This is fake him because he looks hot. He's not the regular. Yeah, the regular, the scraggly version of the him. homeless styles. Yeah. Wait, what? Wait, Where is, is she gone? No, she's still there. Oh no! Here come the thing, thing one through fifty. She left. What is the symbol? I don't know. Some blood droppy. Thing. This better not be the ending. 
I have a feeling it is, but this better not be the ending. There needs to be another minute of something. If she wakes up and then the guy is just dead next to her, then at least there's something. But it's probably not going to, because that's satisfying. Still not sure what this whole like can can Marilyn Monroe thing is. Yeah. Cool. Of course. Yeah, that's F you. That's that's F you. Too open ended. Not good. It's not even open ended. Wait, wait. Huh? Yeah, this is this is a mess. Messy. Come on! Lionel you... Messi of a movie. One last shot for the road. This this movie had something going and then it, it, it shit itself. Yeah, okay, so the ending, I, I get it. Open-ended, dystopian thriller, uh, psychological game. It's, it's games, not even open-ended. Butthole city. Open-ended is like Inception or, yeah. Where like at the end they spawn the top, is it reality or not? She's, you don't know. She's left and now what's open-ended? How is she gonna get her job back now that she's been sitting on a couch for like three months? Her husband's actually probably dead. That's not open-ended, it's just next story. It's not open-ended. Okay, it shows reality sucks, people wanna escape it. The true way to escape it is to know that you're escaping, not be brainwashed into escaping. Yeah, I think that majority of the people, assuming that this is modern times, like people that are in our world are going to this reality in the 1950s or some shit. If this was modern times, every single person would be down. Would be like, Wait, I don't have to work. I get to live in a fancy vacation home and just eat and f all the time with no responsibilities. And you're gonna go and make money to support this? Sign me the f up. This is I literally everyone's dream. Boring, but no, that's retirement. But think about it. To go back to the '50s, you would have to give up all tech. So that would suck. I mean, you can't read about garbage on Twitter then, anymore. Then you just like you you yell out to like the patch runner of whoever's making this. Bring us to the 2000s and then just invent internet. I, I see the desire to not be in the simulation, the loop of nothingness. It's re shitty reality is better than fake simulation, which I disagree. Simulation is better. <laughs> reality sucks. And if you hate your reality, if you hate your reality too, I think hit the a like button. Unsatisfying reality is still better than a perfect utopian simul simulation. Utopia I is bad. I, I don't like utopia, and neither should you. No, utopia is great. Utopia doesn't exist. You get to eat whatever you want. That's why it's a simulation. Wait, is, is this real? All right, everybody, Wait, you thank you know how you, you find watching. out if it's real? You go down and check us out on Patreon to watch the full commentary and support your boys. Yeah, the closest you're ever gonna get to escaping your shitty life is to watch And if videos, you really so. wanna get into this amazing simulation, you gotta suck that like button, subscribe. So you get All right, more we're good. I'm gonna go eat my simulation food because I'm starving. <laughs> Adios.